outdoor unit. Um, it's a three ton outdoor condenser. It's American standard as well. We're gonna pull this unit up. We'll put a new pad um, down. We'll put a new pad down on the ground. Um, we're gonna reuse the existing refrigerant lines. We'll just uh, re-insulate the sections that are outside here. Um, new disconnect box on the wall over there with a new electrical whip going into the unit. And that should be it. Um, as far as access back here goes, you can come around the side of the house this way. You'll be able to park on the front street. Uh, be careful, there are some downed cables and wires here, it looks like. So just uh, mind yourself as you're walking back here with some tools. All right, guys, we're going to do a complete replacement here. We're over in Kirkwood. Um, furnace. Um, is 100,000 BTU American Standard Furnace, and then we got an American Standard three-ton coil on top of it. Um, everything looks fairly straightforward down here. Um, I'll get some sizing on our return drop to see if we need to replace that, um, but if not, there is five inches of space there between uh, between the, the return and the furnace, so we could slide a five-inch April Air Media cabinet in that. Our flue pipe has already got a flue liner installed in it. Um, so we'll just go from the flue T here back down into the new system. So you're gonna need, um, just bring six foot of four inch and three elbows. That should be more than enough. Our electrical is okay on the side of the unit here. Our refrigerant lines run out of the front of the unit and then directly up into the ceiling and then straight outside right there. Gas line is okay. There is a shutoff valve here for the system. Um, I imagine a union's inside of the cabinet there. Um, so we'll just break it and build it back into the, the existing shutoff valve. Um, over here on this side, we're gonna have to build a new plenum from our new furnace, uh, from our new coil up into the existing ductwork. pretty straightforward you can see where the condensate drain line runs into the floor right here so nothing really stands out of the ordinary to me on this one that should be it uh, breaker panels over here in the corner um, and it is a cutler hammer breaker center or breaker panel we got a double 40 amp breaker for the air conditioner here. So chances are we're just gonna end up putting a fuse disconnect outside. That should be everything on the inside.